Most people think they need a high-end super expensive laptop for data analysts. But what if I told you that's a huge mistake? I've spent the last few years working with AI and data analytics, cleaning data sets, running SQL queries, and building dashboards. Through real-world experience, I've seen how the right laptop can make a noticeable difference in speed and efficiency. Stick around because by the end of this video, you will not only know the best laptop for data analysts, but I will also reveal a game-changing insight that will not only save your money, but will also boost your productivity. Now, before we jump into the actual laptop recommendation, let's clear up a big misconception. Having the most powerful spec doesn't mean a good performance for data analysts. See, data analysis is different from gaming or video editing. You are not looking for insane GPU power. There are four key things that makes a laptop perfect for data analysts. First up, the processor. You don't need an overkill Ultra 9 or Ryzen AI 9 unless you are crunching massive datasets. But at least 12th generation Intel i3 or 5th generation Ryzen 5 is the bare minimum. Next, RAM. 8GB is the absolute minimum. 16GB is the sweet spot for most analysts. And if you're dealing with large data sets, 32GB will keep things battery smooth. Storage, if you're still considering an HDD, don't. Always go for NVMe SSD. They are way faster and not nearly as expensive as they were a few years ago. Now, battery and portability. No one wants to stuck with a wall charger. If you're moving around a lot, aim for at least 6 to 8 hours of battery life. Some high performance laptops drain battery faster. So you have got to find the right balance. Now here's the real question. How do you get the best combination of these specs without overspending on the things you don't need? This price range offers laptops that will get the job done without breaking the bank. The MSI Modern 14 priced at $29,990 is one of the cheapest functional options available. It comes with an Intel Core i3-1215U processor which has 6 cores and 8 threads. With 8GB of RAM and 512GB of SSD, it provides a smooth experience for the beginners. This means it can handle basic tasks like running SQL queries, working with Excel, and writing Python scripts for simple data analysis. However, the biggest limitation here is the RAM. 8GB is just enough for lightweight tasks, but if you are running Power BI, Jupyter Notebook with multiple data sets, or heavy browser multitasking, you will start noticing the lag. A better option in this range is the Asus VivoBook Go 14 which costs 36,990. It features the aimed Ryzen 5 7520U processor, which, despite having fewer cores than the Intel i3, offers better overall efficiency and battery life. The biggest advantage is that it comes with LPDDR5, which is significantly faster than the DDR4, making multitasking much smoother. However, the RAM is still limited to 8GB, which means working with large data sets will be slowed down. If you can push your budget a little further, the Lenovo V15 at 39,990 is a great choice. This laptop is powered by AMD Ryzen 7 7730U processor, which has 8 cores and 16 threads. That makes a massive difference when running complex Excel formulas, SQL queries, or Python scripts that require more processing power. If you are serious about learning data analytics and want a machine that won't slow you down too soon, this is a solid choice. The Lenovo ThinkBook 16G6 at 44,999 is an another excellent option. It features a 6-core 12-thread Ryzen 5 7535U processor, which delivers strong performance for most data analyst workload. The 16GB RAM ensures smooth multitasking, and the bigger 16-inch screen makes it easier to work with multiple windows side by side. However, it is slightly heavier than other laptops in this price range. Starting at 49,990, the Lenovo IdeaPad Slim 3 is a great entry-level professional laptop. It comes with an Intel Core i5 12450H processor, which has 8 cores and 12 threads. The 16GB of LPDDR5 RAM ensures that everything runs smoothly without slowdowns, making it extremely fast for running SQL queries, processing large Excel files, and handling multiple applications simultaneously. For those who work with particularly large data sets or need better multi-core performance, the Lenovo ThinkBook 16 at 54,990 is a solid upgrade. This laptop features an AMD Ryzen 7 7730U processor which has 8 cores and 16 threads, making it one of the best options for running Power BI, working with databases, and performing CPU-intensive tasks. The larger 16-inch screen also provides more workspace, which can be very useful when working on data visualization. The Dell Inspiron 5630 at 63980 offers a great balance of performance, battery life, and build quality. It is powered by an Intel Core i5-1340P processor, which has 12 cores and 16 threads. The P-series processor is faster than the U-series found in most budget laptops, ensuring a much smoother experience when handling multiple applications. The battery life is also better than many competitors in this price range. However, one drawback is the RAM is sold, meaning it cannot be upgraded in the future. 
Now for macOS users, the Apple MacBook Air M1 priced at $63,990 is an excellent choice. The M1 chip provides an optimized and highly efficient experience for data analysts using Python, SQL and R programming. The battery life is outstanding, often lasting over 15 hours on a single charge. However, the biggest limitation is the 8GB of unified RAM and the 256GB SSD. Stepping up to $70,000 to $90,000 price range brings in significant better options. The first laptop in this list is the HP 15 AI, which is priced at $72,990, is one of the best AI-ready laptops in this segment. It is powered by an Intel Core Ultra 5 125H processor which has 14 cores and 18 threads. This provides exceptional performance for large SQL queries, Power BI dashboards and Python scripts that involves complex data transformations. It also features the Intel Arc A370M GPU. The Asus VivoBook 16X X 72,990 comes with NVIDIA RTX 4050 graphic card. The combination of the Intel Core i5-12500H processor and 16GB RAM ensures the both CPU and GPU workloads run efficiently, which makes it ideal for machine learning and AI applications. Now, the Mac users looking for a high-performance yet lightweight machine should consider the Apple MacBook Air M2. Priced at 77,990, the M2 chip provides a faster and more efficient experience for data analysts with better optimization for Python and R environments. Now, for professional working with large data sets, machine learning models, or AI tools, Premium Laptop offers the most power and longevity. The first laptop in this list is the Lenovo IdeaPad Pro 5. Priced at 1,4990, is one of the most powerful laptop in this segment. It features the Intel Core Ultra 9 185H processor with 16 cores and 22 threads, making it capable of handling even the most demanding workloads. The 32 gigs of LPDDR5X RAM ensures smooth performance, while the Intel Arc A370M GPU allows for better performance in AI-related tasks. And here's the shocking truth. Some high-end laptops actually perform worse than some of the mid-range laptops for data analysts. And it all comes down to the power limit and the thermal design. Many premium ultrabooks and sleek high-end laptops packs powerful CPUs, but because they are designed to be thin and portable, they can't cool those processors efficiently. This means the CPU doesn't run at full speed for long run. It gets hot, throttles down, and performs worse than a cheaper laptop with a better thermal design. So what should you do? Instead of blindly paying for the highest end models, look for reviews that test sustained performance, not just the peak performance. A laptop that can maintain high speed is way better than one that only hits high speed for a few seconds. So before you make your purchase, think beyond just the specs. Look at real world performance and thermal efficiency. That's how you get the best laptop for your money. But what if your work goes beyond just data analysts? Maybe you are also diving into machine learning, AI, and even deep learning. And that's exactly why I've made a dedicated video on the best laptop for data science and the best laptop for AI and machine learning. So if that's something you need, make sure to check them out. I will link them in the description and up here on the screen. So now you know exactly which laptop fits your need as a data analyst. If you choose wisely, you can save money and you still get the top tier performance. If this video helped you, hit that like button. And if you need a laptop recommendation based on your specific need, drop a comment down below and I will try to help you out. And if you are planning to buy one of these laptops, check out the links down below in the description box. Those are affiliate links which means if you use them, you will get the best deals and also it will support the channel with no extra cost to you. Thanks for watching and as always stay awesome, keep vibing and I will see you in the next one.